10 web AI website builder tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how you can use 10 web and how you can use it to create yourself a website. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. Now 10 web is an AI website builder that can help you generate websites easily by just typing in a few words and it is not free. There is a pricing plan, but you can go ahead and get started for free. So if I come over here onto the pricing plans, you can see these are the pricing plans for 10 web AI builder. So you can see it starts at $10 per month, which is going to be the starter plan. And you can get started for free over here. And in it, you will get the website builder, drag and drop editor on Elementor, Elementor AI assistant with over 5,000 words. You get unlimited AI image generations. You get a free custom domain up to $30. High performance hosting by Google Cloud which is pretty cool. They give you a 99.9% .9 uptime guarantee, which is amazing. And it's across all the boards. Monthly visitors, you get 10,000 monthly visitor capacity over here. And SSD storage, you get around a 10 gigabytes of SSD storage, automated one-click migration option, free SSL certifications, and you also get a 90 plus page speed core, search engine optimization, and for Cloudflare Enterprise CDN, just for four dollars per month if you choose to have that and you also get 24 7 customer care now these were for the starter plan if you go with the ai premium you get all of those except a few changes instead of the 5000 word limit you get 50k word limit all right and instead of 10,000 monthly visitors, you get 50K monthly visitors. And instead of 10 gigabytes, you have 15 gigabytes. And that's pretty much it. Those were the only differences between these two. But it's a pretty good deal considering it's just $5 more than the starter one. But if you go with the ultimate one, you get unlimited everything. And you get unlimited AI assistant, AI unlimited image generation. You get 200K monthly visitor capacity, 20 gigabytes. And you also get multi-site support which you don't get in the other two and you also get faster load times as well so you get a more optimized site and your support is going to be more of a vip priority support so keep that in mind if you want to go really really in deep just simply click on all features and it'll show you all the features that they offer so pretty cool deal when it comes to ai website builders now this one was for businesses if you go with e-commerce it's going to be different and it's going to give you some different options for agency as well it's going to be a little bit different so you can come over here and check out all the pricing and all of the features out so you can go ahead and make a more informed decision so now that we know how much it's going to cost let's go ahead and get started so to create a website you, all you got to do is just simply click on generate your website all right and no credit card is required i might i just wanted to add that as well and then you will have these three options so you have generate with ai right create a new website with ai recreate convert a non-wordpress site to a wordpress site with ai for this one you have to insert a url to recreate the, its layout with ai and then you have migrate wordpress site to 10 web hosting so if you already have a wordpress website some over there you can go ahead and migrate it since these two options don't apply to us we're going to go ahead and go with the first one where we create a new website with ai we're going to click on proceed and over here what kind of website do you want to create i want to create an informational website or i want to create a website with an online store so over here depending on what your answer is you are good to go so i'm going to go ahead and select the second option so we'll select this option right here and click on next and here is basically where you go ahead and type what your store is about so over here search for your store right so you have bottled water supplier online supporting goods store best-selling author used appliance accessory stores right you have a bunch of different options over here if you scroll down below but you know it depends on you what you want so over here let's go ahead and search for e-commerce store right here we're going to search for that and click on next and then over here you enter in your store name and describe what your store is about and if you have your own domain you can click next but if not you can click no so i'm going to fill this out and i'm going to type in all of these informations and once you've written this all you got to do is move on to the next one so again if you have a domain just simply select yes if not click no and that's what we're going to do select no and over here you can enter the domain desired name whatever and then click next 
And after that, you will arrive over here into step number three, where you have products and categories. So you have graphic tees, vintage. You can go ahead and change some of these up. These are just, you know, AI profiles that it generated because of the description. So we're going to leave it over here and click on generate. And here, basically, you go ahead and sign up onto their store. So you can either sign up with your email address, first name, last name, or password, and right? Or you can just sign up with your Google account. So after that, it's going to load up and it's going to go ahead and start generating your website. So give it a couple of minutes and we should be good to go. So here, as you can see, it's creating the blank website. It's going to do all of this. So we're going to leave it over here for a couple of minutes and come back to it in a sec. And here we go. So as you can see, it says, congrats, your website is now successfully created. So let's go ahead and click on preview and edit. And here we go. So this is the website that it created and it looks really cool. Some of these images are, of course, AI generated, as you can tell by their textures and how they look, but they're actually pretty good. Like some of them are really, really good. Like this one right here, uh, even though it's a hoodie, but I think it's backwards or I don't know if that's the design or whatnot, but kind of looks like a backwards hoodie, but it looks pretty good. So as you can see, it came up with a pretty cool and decent designs. You've got your hero section here. You have your collection, all the companies or all the clothing companies over here, all the collection that you have. You have the name, you have the shop button right here, and then you have the categories right here. So you have urban clothing, retro apparel, and classical clothing. And then you have popular right now, which looks pretty cool. And then you have their latest arrivals over here. And then you have this small little section where you can see some of the testimonials from some of our customers. And then the about us section or, you know, what you want to call it. And then we have the footer run. You know what? Overall, the website looks pretty decent and looks really, really good. And the one thing that I would change is, you know, the layout of categories because it's just going way off to the left-hand side. I'd rather have it in the middle somewhere right here. This section also looks pretty good. And yeah, all that's left for us to do is just enter in our own style in it if you want to and change up some of the elements and we should be good to go. So here on the left hand side, you can see we have the option. So right here, we can edit the website with the 10x website builder. We can make a quick customization option with the fonts and colors, we, or we can regenerate the website entirely. It depends on you. So let's go ahead and select the editor and edit it with the Elementor editor right here. So this section right here, we should be able to move it around, I believe, but I don't know if I can. So let's go ahead and click on this edit button, but it says right here, I believe this section cannot be edited for some reason. Can I edit some other section as well? I don't think I can. Can I add stuff to it? Let's go ahead and check it out. So these are some of the basic options that we get, right? And these are the general ones. So let's go ahead and can I delete this section? No, I cannot. This is weird. I don't think I can delete any section, but let's go ahead and add a section right here. No, I can't even add it. Okay, so to edit it, you actually need to go ahead and try it for free over here. If you click on try for free, it's going to take you over to the dashboard. And then you actually have to go ahead and select a plan. So this is the e-commerce plan right here. So if you click on try it for free, you have to enter in your payment method and actually go ahead and buy it. It's going to be $0 as of right now, but later on, it's going to go ahead and ask you for some payment option. But as you can see, it was pretty easy to go ahead and create a website. I'm not going to go ahead and do that right now. I'm not going to go ahead and add my payment info, but the overall, it was actually very easy to go ahead and create a website. After that, I'm pretty sure all you need to do is just fill out the payment plan and start editing your website and over here on the left hand side you can see in the dashboard you have all the other options like ai builder this is going to be your navigation here you can set uh, home pages and stuff like that and all the other pages and then you have your e-commerce option here you can find all of your products your orders your customers as well right here as you can see currently we can't access any of the options because you know we require a payment plan but yeah pretty easy to use and pretty easy to create a website with the 10 web ai so thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye